the next question is the correct options about entropy is r uh, option a for the reaction m solid plus 2h plus gas plus uh, giving h2 gas plus uh, m2 plus i equals if de cell by dt is r by f then the entropy change of the reaction is r assume that the entropy and internal energy change are temperature independent uh, so basically uh, we know this formula directly that de uh, by dt de by dt is equal to delta s by nf delta s by nf uh, the n is basically the number of moles of electrons exchanged in the reaction as you can see that m is changing from 0 to plus 2 and h is uh, changing from plus 1 to 0 so the n value would be 2 for uh, this reaction so delta s by nf means this delta s by 2f and this value they have given as r by f so this means that delta s for this reaction should be 2r it should be 2r and uh, they have given the delta s for the reaction is r which is of course not correct so a option is not correct uh, b option the cell reaction pt solid h2 gas h plus 0 0.01 it's a concentration cell of hydrogen gas uh, is an entropy driven process now as you know the net reaction for this uh, net reaction for this cell uh, is h meaning uh, it's the same reaction taking place in both the containers so the delta h for uh, this reaction would be zero and because it is spontaneous so delta g has to be negative and as delta g is equal to delta h minus t delta s as this is zero so for negative delta g the delta s has to be positive so the reaction the cell reaction is actually entropy driven so the option B is absolutely correct. Option C, for racemization of an optically active compound, delta S is uh, positive. In racemization, uh, because both the products, and uh, both the enantiomers have the same uh, types of bonds, there is no change, there is no difference in the bond energy. For example, you have uh, these two compounds. This and its enantiomer now these two have no difference in the bond en energy so uh, definitely the delta h value for this change would be zero so again just like the previous option the only driving force for the racemization is uh, entropy increase so option c is also correct Option D, delta S is 0 for this NiH2 whole 6 2 plus plus 3 En giving Ni En 3 2 plus plus 6 H2 where N is where En is ethylene diamine. Now this is basically chelation. Uh, so uh, when uh, if you see the number of uh, ions present in the reactant side, there are four uh, molecules present in the reactant side. One of this complex ion and three this total four. In the product side, you have one of this complex and six water molecules, that is total seven. So whenever you replace a monodentate ligand uh, with a bidentate or a tridentate or a polydentate ligand, then what happens, the number of ions will increase in the product side. So this chelation is also an entropy uh, driven uh, process as the number of uh, molecules increase in the formation of, uh, in, in the replacement of monodentate ligand with the polydentate ligand. So option D is also correct so for this question the correct answer would be b c and d